What have you been up to? Watching the slicker drama. Oh my fucking god, dude. Like, people... I cannot fucking believe that so many yes. people gave that guy money. I, I, okay, like, one one person I could truly understand reasoning with him, and that's the only person... Like, Who? Coming. You mean, like, train? Yeah, Tyler? Yeah. Yeah. Like, I, I, I... I already knew it. Whenever they were, like, adding it up and y'all were in the disc, uh, well, I was like, they're missing, like, one major person, I guarantee you. I just, like... I kind of assumed, because like, I mean, he helps people out all the time, that but means, like, like that guy, he donates more money than the Red Cross. Yeah, like, literally. Like, I bet, I, I bet if you add up Trainwreck's total, like, fucking charitable wow. donations, it's more than the Obamas. I, I like, it is pr you. probably more than the fucking Obama. Like, this guy is giving away money, like, that shit's on fire. It's just like, I hope, people say, I hope he help, it gets the help he needs. I hope he goes to the jail cell he needs. Like, I don't give a fuck about you, man. Like, if, if you're fucking doing this shit, and you're hurting other people, I don't give a fuck what happens to you. I don't care if you get it's help. I don't care if you don't get help. I don't care what ha I don't care if you win the lottery tomorrow. Just... This person is a fucking parasite. Like, I, so I have no that's I was, sympathy. That's what I, I, I sent you some DMs. Yeah, yeah. All the stuff that he did because it's via PayPal. Right. Your bank will dispute. You can't dispute via PayPal. It's 180. You got 180 days. So, like, yeah. If your you, bank will dispute. Your mm -hmm. bank. Not your PayPal. Right. Your bank. There it's you go. It's very disputable. Very disputable. Mm hmm. Your bank won't even question you. Your bank will literally be like, okay. Yeah. Because I doubt people are just sitting there, you know, spamming fraud on other charges. I mean, unless you're doing that. Then. Yeah. But your bank won't question it, and your bank will refund you the money. Well, like, you just tell them, like, what happened. Like, yo, I got fucking defrauded. Like, mm -hmm. that that's what it was. It's mm -hmm. clearly def uh, fraud. He's lucky it isn't ground that much in the hole. Yeah, exactly. Like, he had a future and fucked it up. Like, I bet, yeah, I bet he's crying. Yeah, he actually is crying. Because, like, now, like, he had a good thing going, uh, and, and, and now he can't what? do it anymore. So what? Good thing going with what? Like, I don't with, with fucking begging for people money, people's money, oh, right? He's yeah, getting people's like, fucking money. But I mean, he's not living. It, well, maybe he is, but it doesn't seem like he's living this lavish lifestyle. So he really was throwing all this. Shit. Oh yeah, he was. He was. Yeah, he was living like a degenerate. I mean, absolutely, he was. And, and then people like I love the fucking donations. The people, yeah. fuck you, slicker. Like, all, all these other ones, like, oh, did you see Mizkiff resubbed? He resubbed to Slicker during the fucking video. Oh, Yo, my God. I saw that, and I saw yeah. your face, and I was like... Of fucking, of fucking course, There's got to be some employee guidelines here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, no wonder, obviously, Slicker came on Miz's stream today. He, uh... He resubbed him. Yeah, the yeah, I mean, paid him for it, obviously. Yeah, yeah. That's he was addicted. It wasn't a scam. Generally thought he, he... He generally thought he'd pay them back. Really? He genuinely thought he'd pay them back. Really? So why, if he genuinely thought that he paid them back, why did he only pay back the streamers? Who did he, who did he pay back? So he paid back Miz, he paid back, um, I think... Uh, Wait, so he actually paid Miz back? How much money did Miz give him? A grand. Okay. Yeah, just a thousand bucks. Just whatever. Um, he paid Destiny back, he paid Daft That's back. That's like Miz's tires yeah. getting re realigned and shit. It's actually, it's less. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I used to, yeah, told me about it. And so, like, it's just nuts. Like, Nam, yeah, so he he paid back different people that were streamers. Like, ooh, dude, I was sitting behind my screen, bro, and I was like, yo, if you, if I just gave you, like, five grand and you laugh in my face... I would want you, to fucking kill you. Bro, I, like, I, was yes. like, I was like, dude, couldn't it be me? You could have five friends with you. Yeah. Bro, I'm swinging on you the mi like you're about to catch the fucking hands, bro. Like, I promise you, like. I, I would, I would go out of my way. You. I might not do anything to you today, but I'm gonna remember you. Yeah. And in ten years, twenty years, five years, ten days. I'm about to buy your house. There will, you. yes, there will be a moment <laughs> where I get my chance, and I will take dude, it. Dude, I literally was like, yeah. I was like, man, I wish I had lent slicker money because I would have <laughs> dog shit out of him. <laughs> I, I would have been fucking pissed, man. Like, I I, if like, if I didn't get my fucking money, I'd have told him like, you know listen. What I'd be worried about? Like, Knut's a big motherfucker. Knut? That is a big How, ass like, dude. Like, the balls on, Bro, on like fucking that Sucker. Band like, has like you... 150. Dude, I weighed myself, right? Because I used to work you out. You saw a lot. he won the Arnold, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Like, it's. This isn't like, that oh. Is insane. Like, he's just working out, you know? Like, no. That's a fuck. Like, that's like what? Like, the, the second or yeah. third, like, most prestigious competition. Yeah. It's insane, that's, man. That's like one he below the Olympia. Survived. Is it one? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I didn't remember. Yeah, and the Arnold Classic is huge. It's Holy huge. fuck! Yeah, and, yeah. and like the guy, the guy literally fucking won it. Oh, and it's like 
bro, like, uh, even myself, like, I don't even work out anymore. I'm 180. Yeah. And right. I was like, dude, can you imagine? Because he's probably like 250, 260 solid. Not okay. an ounce of fat on him. Right. He, <laughs> he's a big, I mean, I've met him, right? Yeah, I, I've, I've known him for like years I was, now. I was like, dude, like. He's playing WoW now. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. Game, warrior. <laughs> yeah, of course. Like, perfect. <laughs> My man. <laughs> Button, like, up. Go. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. And like the thing is, he got killed by wolves the other day in Duskwood. <laughs> hey, you know it is what it is. He just ran past fifteen wolves and got mauled. Yeah, I just like I'm so amazed. Like he just and like you know like what Slicker was doing is he was watching Canute like just absolutely fucking farming with like Camp Canute, like popping off, making oh, tons yeah. of fucking money, and Slicker's just licking his lips. Ooh, Dude, I'm gonna honestly, get a little like, bit of that. I never Ooh. realized like Jesus how he would uh. Like, ask people, like, oh, how's the stream going? Like, yeah. I don't know. Like, I've never. How old are you? How's your stream going? Uh, you know, can you send me money? I'll send you a picture. I'll make a fucking custom video for Dude. you. Dude. It's like an OnlyFans girl. It's like he's taking custom requests. Remember when I was telling you, like, I'm going bald? Uh huh. Bro, look. Oh, yeah. I've, I've got one of those. I'm like, I think it's like underneath here. Yeah. Yeah, I have to doctor. keep it a little longer. It's fucking annoying, right? Yeah, he, he's like. Did yeah, he give you like, the shit that you put on it? Yeah, he's like, yeah, you're, having, yeah. you're having hair loss. And I was like, what the fuck? Right. I was like, I'm gonna lose my hair. He's like, no, like, right now it's just in your beard, so it'll grow back, but yeah. the hair follicles will be white, so when they do grow back, you can't even see them. Right? Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, the, the hair's there. That's crazy. Yeah, the hair's there. It's just white hair. I was that like, is, damn, dude. What? Wow. I, I infect, that's my infected Cody, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Clearly. I mean, it's just... I, I am amazed that, like, he just did it so openly and, like, with so many people. And, like, especially the kind of, like, like, I get if you're gonna finesse streamers, this might sound fucked up, but, like, if you're scamming streamers out of money, yes, it's bad, but it's not that bad. Right, it, it's not that big of it a deal. It wasn't so much that he. It, it's like his own fucking viewers. It's like these people that are like, "Yeah, man, I've got to sell my PS4, and, and you know, like my, uh, uh, like you know, I've got to remortgage my house so I can give you more money to gamble." It's nuts. Yeah, and like that's the, the worst part about it, I think what really fucking pissed me off today, I, I got, I went live this morning. I was like, I was so fucking mad. Like, if you guys watch the vod the first hour of the stream I was mad and the reason why is because like I felt like people were making excuses and they were like well you know it's like he's you know he feels bad for what he did and you know so. he, I think he feels bad that he got caught he a hundred percent feels bad that he got caught because he straight up did the exact same thing it was like three or four days ago you know what made him go live that day be, uh, it was, we were talking about him, right? And yeah, then, because like, you had like forty thousand viewers on your alt channel, and it's like, and, oh and my then, god, one of the largest streamers on the guess, platform. Guess guess who up. he goes? Like, if Mizkif had five K viewers, do you think he would have gone on Mizkif stream? Not a fucking shot, no. not a chance. He went on Mizkif stream because Mizkif had a lot of viewers, and he wanted to. And he's Wait, affected. He went, on Miz's stream? he went on Miz's stream today. Is that right, guys? I, I, I just no want to make sure that like this way. is all. Like, I, I've been I've been chilling with my dad today, so like I don't. Okay, yeah, yeah, so he went on Miz's fucking stream, and he's sitting there, and, like, the other viewers are there, and he's like, oh, I'm gonna pay it back, I'm gonna do, like, a year-long subathon. So this little slimy parasite piece of shit Wait, is what? sitting here on this fucking stream in front of, like, 20, it was like, Wait, not 20, was he it was at like, Miz's house? No, no, no. Oh, I was like, uh, what is it was Miz like, doing? Yeah, like, no. Uh, it was, se it was like 70,000 people watching this shit, and he's going, and he's like, he's advertising his own fucking stream. Are you kidding me? Like, I, I can't what believe- genius. And, and it's like, yeah, no, Miz, content, content genius, right? Yeah. I, I think it's really smart to use this guy's content, but like, imagine the mind of like twitch like twitch is probably allow how can you possibly fucking allow this to happen how do you possibly pokemon was there yeah there's plenty of other people there what? um yeah Dude, well, honestly, i mean they didn't okay, know what he was so gonna say i saw i don't know if you saw this but i saw xqc tweet out that him and ludwig we're are, gonna pay we're gonna try to pay the shit back the thing is like how are they gonna do that because they xqc is gonna do that because he's got a really good sponsorship of stake and so, uh, Ludwig is gonna be able to do that because I'm assuming YouTube, you know, yeah. there was also a really nice payment that was done to Ludwig for moving over to YouTube from Twitch. And so, uh, yeah, and basically, so they, say they've got the money to pay for it, but like, 
but, but they're are not going to be able to reach the little people that are missing and, and also like how can you means test people right like i mean i think that like if they were going to do that what I would want them to do is I would need them to show like a PayPal transaction history and maybe have like a assistant uh, interview each case to make sure that they're all legitimate. Mm -hmm. So it's like, gave the lady who's going through chemo already? Yeah, yeah. So it's like, it's possible you can do that. And like, I don't think they're bailing out Slicker by doing that. I think that it's like, like how the fuck are you gonna, like nobody's gonna get their money back from this guy. No, of course right? not. Doesn't like, have they're any not bailing money. him out. It's more so like- They're helping the viewers who, who yeah. like it was foolish to give him money. It was absolutely foolish to give him money and they Some shouldn't of the people have done talking, it. Like I was like, you guys sound like, like not to be rude to any of them that are content creators. You, you sound like stupid ass kids. Yeah. Yeah, they did, and, and it was it was dumb as hell that they like, that they let it happen. And then you asked yeah. one of them, you're like, "How old are you?" And he's like, "Oh, I'm like 20." I was like, "Yeah, 24 or something like that." Yeah, I, was uh, like, I remember. Bro, like, it's nuts. Like, it, it's like, yeah, he's using the viewer stimulus checks. And I remember, like, whenever the stimulus checks came out, like, streamers started memeing that, like, you should give them their stimulus, your stimulus checks to, like, all these rich streamers. And like, people started getting really mad about this. And then Slicker does it for real, though. Like, he's actually doing it for real. Like, he's actually like, hey, you know. Like, no cap, but I could really use that $800. And he just took all that money from people. And I just, like, I really have zero sympathy for the guy. Like, I don't care. Oh, he's addicted to gambling. Oh, really? Wow. Is he addicted? Like, I mean, the guy, this is actually, like, not a joke. Like, I thought it was a joke. The guy legitimately stole fleshlights from Ms. Kiff's house of Mia Malkova, Rich's girlfriend. Wait, that like, wasn't Like, they a were joke? fleshlights. Rich yeah. wasn't joking? No, he wasn't. Like, where is it? I, I think that, uh... Did you message him? Yeah, I did. He says, Yo, motherfuckers stole the fleshlights, drag him. Oh! Like, it actually, like, this oh, shit that's actually a, oh, happened. Oh, those are actual DMs. Jesus. Yeah. Oh, my God. Like, because I thought this, it's like... Yeah, I saw, the, like, I saw the clip. Okay, we're not going to show this one on stream. But, uh, yeah, apparently he got... Yeah, he did get the... <laughs> guys, the fleshlights are safe, okay? Yeah, it's okay. But it's just nuts that so many people are just... Uh, that's crazy, dude. Like, well, it's what? like How do you go to somebody's house and well, just... Well, like, what I'm shit? saying is, like, the dude's a fucking thief, man. Like, he, it's not like, oh, it's his gambling addiction. What do you think he's gambling these fucking fleshlights? Get the fuck out of here. No, he's just a piece of shit. And then all, the only thing, like... How does what, somebody like that What made become... Slicker popular, here's what made him popular, is that he would go on, you know Austin show? Uh, yeah, well, okay, well, Austin... So, like, I, I know what you're talking about, because, like, yeah. about a month or two ago, I did some stuff with, like, uh... Sub Caitlin, uh, okay. uh, cute bot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yes, I do know. So, so you know the circle. Yeah, right? because there, and then I immediately got out of it because I was like, "This is a this is inter this is interesting, right?" Yeah, I was like, "This, yeah, entire area of Twitch is just not." Gonna and I was like, "This city must be purged." <laughs> Yes. Uh, no. No. Yes. And yes, and those babe. people. Yeah. Those people are very, um, very interesting. Dude, I was telling people in the guild if they could catch our movie quotes, remember. I would just yeah. give them a hundred gold yeah. for every movie quote I posted. But I know half of them wouldn't, so I would just keep all my gold anyway. It's not yeah, of again, course. Because I know they won't get them. No. No fucking shot. And I remember. Uh, so, did so, you so, a memo? so yeah. <laughs> So yeah, I need you to come in on a uh, Saturday and uh, actually on a uh, Sunday too. Did you get the new letterhead? Yeah. It was in the memo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, you have heard of your TPS reports having problems. <laughs> yeah, so like anyway, uh Somebody's got a case of the Mondays. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you get your ass kicked around saying something like that, huh? Me? <laughs> and uh yeah, so the fucking like so Slicker, like his entire fucking shtick was like calling girls on that show fake. So like basically all he did, like Everything that he has done on Twitch is he was a parasite towards these girls, mm -hmm. and then he became a parasite towards the entire website. I feel, personally, that people that speak that way will do it because it's going to attract a certain consensus of viewership that feel like, well, 
I haven't been able to say that I was like this. Da, 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 well, and like, like they have, they like, have yeah. like this lingering resentment towards yes. women yes. because and, they couldn't get a girlfriend. And they're like, this guy's speaking on behalf of. He's yeah, saying it, like, he's yeah, say, like, he's calling it how it is. He's yeah. saying it how it is. Oh, it's well, so fucking yo, annoying. You know what else you missed? What's that? Steve will do it. He's on Twitch too. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know oh, that. His entire YouTube channel. Oh yeah, for gambling, right? To stake. Wait, what? To what happened? Stake. So Steve will do it. Um, has an alt channel. And uh -huh. this happened because it's canceled now. His entire channel's gone. It's gone. Deleted. Yeah, yeah. Six million subscribers gone. So he posted on an alt channel that he doesn't even own, but it's technically Steve will do its name. Uh -huh. his, his main channel's gone. 6.5 million followers, subscribers gone. Mm -hmm. So they canceled him without a question. On YouTube allows you to advertise gambling as long as you don't put the dot com. In, oh yeah, yeah. I saw like, that. I saw that today. You, you can say I'm on stake. I'm yeah. on this. I'm on this. I'm on this. Whatever you want to do. I'm on. Uh, what is? What was the other one that? Uh, uh, punt. Punt. Yes. Yeah. You can put all of that. You can say you're on this site. You yeah, can yeah. do whatever. You just can't put the dot com. Right. Well, his editor slipped up and put one of the videos. It said dot com in the video, and but it was on an alt friend. channel, not even his main channel, because his uh -huh. main channel is mainly philanthropy. Which he does. That man gives a lot of money away too. Obviously, I wonder where he gets it. I wonder why. Yeah. Yeah. No shit. So, out of nowhere, YouTube calls him in the morning on like last Thursday, and they're or two weeks ago, like a couple Thursdays ago, and they were like, "Hey, uh, just so you know, by the end of the day, we're gonna go ahead and remove your entire channel." No surprise. No Boom. Yeah. Gone instantly. Instantly gone. And this is like the owner of of Happy Dad, Full right. Send, like, boom, gone because of that. <clears throat> I was like, yo, I mean, I like his, his content. Yeah, it, it's just like the guy's just fucking done, right? It's yeah. nuts that, like, that just happens to somebody so fast. What would happen on Twitch? Right, they're just done. And it's like, what would happen on Twitch if he did that? No. Uh, probably nothing. I mean, that, that's what would happen. Like, maybe yeah, he wouldn't he get an his, ad. He on streams his, his stake on Twitch. So, like, is he on Twitch right now? Yeah, like, I mean, not Twitch. right this moment, but yeah, he is he's on yeah, Twitch. He has yeah. Twitch. yeah, he can maybe get, like, three, four K handy. It's nuts, man. Holy fuck. And is there proof he gambled away? Could be on a bank account, could be good excuse people to knock the back. Oh, you mean like Slicker gambled the money away? So like, what do you, th do you think that, what, what, like, so, Let me tell what you. has Slicker ever done that would make you think that he is smart enough to pull something like that off? Nothing. Nothing. Literally nothing. There's never you, ever it's been not an drugs indication or of that. alcohol because of the way he looks facially sound. Like I've seen people that have. Those, oh yeah, yeah, like, yeah. He looks, like the, not the red face. Like there's no, no other. No, there's like no ticks no or anything ticks, like that. No, no, his skin is clear. Like he's yeah. properly speaking. He doesn't have any uh, like skin issues. He yeah. looks healthy. Like he has no. He he doesn't have an addiction chemically. It doesn't. It doesn't look like that to me either. No, not at all. So if that was it, I would honestly, if he was hooked on drugs, I might be more sympathetic to it. Yeah. I well, might be like he's stuck. Like he's. You can't get out of that. Yeah. This is a mental thing that he chose to make all those decisions. Well, he decided there was a time in Slicker's I life where like, he decided I like to gamble. Instantly PayPal'd you like sixteen bucks for the Chiefs uh, yeah. pizza we got one time, and I was like, oh man, I Zach paid for my pizza. Fuck. What if I'm like Slicker now because I Zach paid for my pizza. <laughs> No, Holy that's okay. Shit. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you're fine. I was like, fine. Zach, I'm going to pay you the $16 for the pizza, I promise. Yeah. No, I, I get that, man. And it's like, I... It, it's it's not like a big deal if you... <laughs> $16 easy. <laughs> yeah, it, it's like I borrowed money from Jeff before, like 10 years ago. Jeff has borrowed money from me, I think, probably the same time. Yeah. Or borrowed WoW Gold or something like that. I mean, not borrow, then the WoW Gold's case that no he stole my golden wow from epic flying he stole your gold for his epic flying Nowadays and his like justification gold. yeah his justification <laughs> for it was zach's mom will just give him more gold anyway it doesn't even well, he matter he was talking to you and, directly so yes he said, your mom will just give him gold yeah and the worst <laughs> part is that he was right like she was like oh cody he took your money again well, we got the more. Yeah. House in Booty Bay. I know, man. It was nuts. And so, anyway, like, yeah. So he, uh, what was what was it saying? Fuck. I was. I got so sidetracked so about. Yeah. So like, he made the decision to gamble. And like, what I mean is like, he is obviously much more of. This is not the story of just some hapless addict, because a hapless addict doesn't also go to somebody else's house and steal fleshlights. 
That's fucking weird. That he doesn't go and fucking talk a bunch of shit about these girls and call them fake and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, after I read his DM, yeah. I was like, yo, fuck that guy. Yeah, th this guy, like, it, it, there is way, way, way more stuff going on that is also a character indication. So it's if, like, if it's only him, like, oh, man, can I please just have some more money? I need it. Like, if that was the only thing, I would be much more willing to take sympathy for it. You know what I thought was hilarious, too? Like, he had, like, what, like, eight, 9,000 viewers the other day? And I heard somebody yeah. say, like, yo, he's never had that many. I was like... That's true. I was like, bro, what? This man's sitting with <laughs> almost 10K viewers, never had that much, but he does yeah. some off-the-wall shit, and people just eat that shit up. Oh yeah. I was like, you know what? Slicker better run some ads right now. It, it it's insane. Like, like run I, some ads. Hit them with ads. <laughs> I don't understand how people are like, people just let that shit go. Mm -mm. I I'm genuinely amazed. He was perma banned on GTRP within two days. Character knowledge right there. Yeah. Well, he was perma banned for being like, wasn't he just being like, uh, abusive towards girls on GTA RP? And it's like, oh hey, this is my character. Like I don't remember. So what? like. Yeah, it was, yeah, sexist, apparently. Like, this guy just doesn't like women. Like, he, he's a creep, he's a fucking weirdo, and, uh, I, like, I mean, he stole fleshlights. I mean, like, I think that's about all you that's need to really know. That's really odd, dude. That's, like, I can't wrap my mind around that. It's like, that's and like... And it's weird, because I know that's like Rich some, personally. That's like some, that's goblin behavior. Yeah, and it's like, it's so odd to me, and it's so, that's so weird, because I, yeah. I, I've been to, you know, Mrs., and I've met Rich in person, and I've met all these people, so it's so fucking yeah. weird, dude, like... It, 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 yeah, it's a Andrew Tate 2.0. No, it's not. It's Andrew. No. It's Andrew Tate 0. 0.5, yeah. right? Uh, think about Andrew Tate uh, without the cool sunglasses, no cool stories, Bugattis, uh, no Bugattis, no bitches, uh, fucking nothing, no talents at all, no wins in in any sort of fight. Like, yeah, he's not even point, point zero, 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 zero fucking five. Yeah. No muscles, no fuck. Yeah, no money, nothing. And, and so, like, what what's amazing to me is that... I mean, before Tate started doing all his own stuff... Yeah. He did actually have to earn some money. He did earn... He did win fights. He, he did. did. He was... And, and yeah. it, it's not like... I mean, the guy, like, he says some really sus stuff, absolutely. Yeah. But, y you know, it he did actually do some things, which is yeah. better than a lot of other fucking people. How can Kai do this? How is it that he... Like, bro, look oh, at that. Oh, did you see the bazooka ASMR? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Okay, all right, I gotta... Your Rage Scam by Slicker. Here, I don't know if I can put it on fucking speaker. Yo. Let me see what it says. Uh, fucking... Did you see him with the bazooka ASMR? No, I didn't fucking see that shit. <laughs> but I'll tell you how much I gave. This shit was hilarious. Six bands. Damn! Oh my fucking god! Six, dude, your rage oh gaming gave. Uh, did you see his no. tweet? No. Oh what fuck! I'll fuck? show you this shit. Um, Who give me one second. Your rage I didn't even fucking know. How did Slicker even know him? Dude. It, Sorry, that shit was too loud. I I don't know like how how loud it is in my head because I don't have the, the headphones on. Look, look at this shit. Wait, where is it? Fucking. We're not gonna say what he said. Uh, I, I'm sharing wealth too easily. And look what it is. He's like, afraid to say, well, I got you. I got you with a loan, bro. Hey, everybody makes that mistake once. You know? Like, makes it say, wait, for asking, yeah, yeah. And then there he is, obviously, sending, you, you know, know why? his it's personalized invoice, message. Right? Uh, so it can't be used uh, against yeah. him in court. Yeah, because there's nothing, there's, yeah. Um, I know you're good for it. Yeah, I think that's the reason. And then he fucking posted that shit. <laughs> He's like, wait a minute. <laughs> Hold up. Oh no, bro! Good, good shot of you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Holy fuck, man! Looks like death warmed over. I mean, like, dude. I like, mean, his career is death warmed over. I'll tell you that. You know what? Yeah. I mean, I would say so, but I guarantee you, there's gonna be some. There's gonna be some of you guys out there that are still gonna chime in. Somebody out there, like, he's still gonna maintain it. I think Unless that there's going to be off the platform. there's somebody like the worst part about it is he can come back and I already predicted what was going to happen. He's going to come back and be like, "Man, this rehab shit is not cheap. <clears throat> it's not cheap to go to rehab, guys." Yeah. Somebody's going to have to somebody's going to have to I, do I this. I know he was watching you. Oh, I know, I no that. fucking, like, no way all, he, he wasn't was watching. watching. He actually stashed all the money using the gambling as a scapegoat. 
uh, to make him look like less of a piece of shit than he really is. Serious question. Uh, no, I, I don't think that he stashed all the money. Uh, I, I genuinely don't think so. It would be crazy if he was, like, some so. actual criminal mastermind. If yeah. We, we fucking if see, he, if we he see was... Slicker, like, in, in three years after he's been broke and lost yeah. all his Twitch and everything. Right? He's, like, in the Maldives and some shit. Like, we right, and he, and he, like, posts models. a video about how he did it all. If he did that, I will honestly... Like, he will be a fucking genius to me. He's gonna end up, like, like that, yeah, like a legend. Dan, like, Dan Bro... Dan Blitzerian? Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, if I was to buy my boys fucking dinner right now, I'd be like, you know, like I yeah. couldn't even fathom giving out ten thousand dollars. Well, like, it's oh, like whenever, God. whenever you're making good money, right? It's like it's a different, it's the same numbers but with more zeros, right? True. And so it's like you're talking about like giving out quarters. It's like if you're making like let's say you know five grand a month, it's it's not the same as you're making like fifty grand a month. So it's the same general idea, but it's like if somebody asks you for like twenty percent of your income in a month. That's a lot of fucking money. That's twenty percent of your income. That's like, insane. Like I would never like I, okay. and like the, some of the people like that that Luke guy, man, thirty thousand dollars. That had to have been everything he had. I I think so. I, you know what's fucked up? His story bothered me the most. Yeah. Uh, from from the ones I heard because right. he. I completely can understand like what he was going through because I've been through it yeah. with myself, with you, and it's like you're not even thinking straight. Like, yeah, yeah, you're, like you're you're fucked up in the head. Like you've got so much problems going on. Like you're stressed out, and you just want to, you want to do, you want to do the right smooth. thing. Yeah, yeah, you want to do the right thing, and you're just like fucked up in the head, right? Yeah, it's, and it's nuts, like, dude. Like, can, I, it's like, yo, what? Like. Yeah, he didn't admit it because he was embarrassed. It's rough, man. Exactly. Like, yeah, because he didn't want to, you know, come out and say like, yeah, I actually let this shit happen to me. It's nuts. He's got like six mil uh, on YouTube. He'll be fine. It's not about whether it's he'll not be about fine if he'll or be not. Fine. Yeah. What? We know he'll be good. And like, that's the thing is like, we're totally like, listen, uh, a lot of these streamers like Botez, like uh, and Alexandra Botez, like she can afford the ten grand. Okay. Yeah. Like it was dumb as. Like, she won like a hundred thousand dollars chess you get, tournament. You're gonna, you gonna buy Slicker into a chess tournament? I watched like, her beat kids in the park in New York for a hundred dollars a piece. Yeah, yeah. So like she's gonna <laughs> like, she's gonna get that money back. It's not gonna yeah, be a big deal. Yeah, like these kids right. are paying hundred dollars just to play with her. Yeah, yeah. And, and so this is not a big deal. And so she's got no problem with that. But there, it's all the uh, the little guys, right? That like that, that they. Yeah, I'm gonna sell like my fucking PlayStation for four hundred dollars, etc. Collecting the DMs to expose them would be good content, but like, nah, it's not now. Everybody it's, did. It's yeah, we're beating a dead horse. Like, yeah, it, it's, it's already out. Yeah, it, it, you can just assume what the DMs are, we're right? Think about how bad they are, and they're worse than that. Botez got scammed. Yeah, yeah, she did. I giving slicker, slicker, giving slicker ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars. That is a lot of money. I just especially to some guy. Wow. In the middle of the UK. Yeah, it's just nuts, man. Shows how little 10k means to her. I could have a billion dollars, and I wouldn't give Slicker ten dollars. True. <laughs> like I, I, that there is. Listen. You know how I knew? Okay, yeah. Chat. Let me tell you this. You know how I knew Zach was finally like something on Twitch. He bought me a bag of chips at the store like five months ago. It was the expensive Zach, bag. It was like the, it was like the fucking the two it was seventy nine bags. Yeah, it was twenty five bucks. Oh, what? Well, bought me and Zach yeah. a bag of chips each, and you're like, no, we were gonna this. pay for it, and yeah. you go, don't worry, it's, it's, I got it. Yeah, me and good. Zach looked at each other. And we were like. Yeah, like I, I, I we're, we're like we balling now. I yeah, I was like, dude, he made it. He bought us the chips. Like, we finally out the project. I'm like, dude, I'm getting a soda too. Fuck this. That's actually, I think that's actually what you did. You're like, oh, actually, whoa, wait, wait, one sec. Wait a minute, I'm getting the gummies and yeah, the coke yeah, too, yeah. dude. I'm getting the soda and I'm getting fucking. Gummies. Zach was like, oh, don't mind if I do. I, it's the okay, rips. might as well. Yeah, Zach, don't mind the rips and the coke. Yeah. So we'll uh, we'll go ahead and we'll look at this. This has been a bit of an update. And so we have Hachu on Slicker scamming her. Here we go. Let's see it. I'm really sad and that I'm really depression, but at least I need to try. 
But she just said he even didn't try. You, you know what? Money was even doesn't matter at the time. I just said because he just... He just didn't think about me. Well, of course he's not going to think about you. He just you. didn't give a fuck about me. I thought of him as my friend. <laughs> at least he was... He was trying to. He should try to. Oh. oh, sorry about that. Yeah, but money is, doesn't matter. Hey, hey, yo, hey, yo, guys, but we shouldn't be mean to him. Because it could hurt his feelings. Hey, yo, like, this shit could hurt his fucking feelings, man. We can't... Bro, like, we can't be mean to him. Like, he's getting his... He can't get his feelings hurt. Oh, my God. Like, is it is a is the shit loud? Like, is it actually loud? Like, if it's loud, I turn the shit down. I don't know. Uh, some cuss back. What the fuck is this? Like, is this some like, I don't know even which drama. Like, is it? Uh, all right, I turn. I turn. I think when X bringing up beef, uh, focusing away from slicker, it doesn't matter. XQC is a fucking child, even though he's twenty seven years old. What's he, he's literally what's a man Hassan child, that for? a baby. Okay, he behaves like a fucking spoiled little kid because he is a spoiled little kid. And his lifestyle will always be facilitated for the rest of his fucking life. I don't give a shit about a dude who eats his toenails on camera when we're talking about something serious. Okay? But what? man, like... You were my friend, bro. And before I was going for my transplant, knowing you're not going to pay me, You're asking for my money that I put together to save my life. And... You had no intention, even though I've already given you money. You never paid that back, and then you asked for another 10k. Before, I'm meant to be going to America to pay for this stuff, man. I just want to know... I know addiction is difficult, but... Were you actually my friend? Ever? No, of course he I just wasn't. want to know that, man. That's all. No, like, he wasn't. I knew you before all of this. I just want to know. I'm sorry, I don't mean to get emotional, and I know you're going through your own shit. But... No, mine doesn't matter. I'm sorry. It's just like, bro. Oh my god. Echo is clip. Yeah, the echo is in the clip. It's just that he's such a bitch. Yeah, it's crazy, man. Oh, he has no remorse at all. I think that he probably feels bad about it, but he's not going to stop doing it, right? Like, I mean, you can do something bad and then be like, man, I really shouldn't be doing this. And then you just do it anyway, right? That's it. He's only upset because he got caught. I think so. Like, if you want me to be totally honest, I think that Twitch, every hour that Twitch goes without permanently banning him, is a disgrace it is an absolute fucking disgrace i'm amazed about this you want to be a psychiatrist clearly tell there's something about him i don't want to diagnose anybody with a mental disorder over the internet and a 40 second clip i don't give a fuck really like i don't care what the mental disorder is i don't care what his problems are they are irrelevant whenever they start affecting other people that's the reality. Like, I don't give a fuck. Oh, well, uh, you know, he's he's got his own problems. He's got his own demons. Oh, really? Well, so that, that makes it okay for him to be a demon instead. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. That's not how it works. I, I gotta, I'll be right back. I get a drink, and then we'll keep going. Oh, shit. Sorry, my bad. I bet that was loud. You should be given a chance to fix this, but if he slips up, everyone should cut him off. Bro, nope. No chances. No chances. He's had a chance for three years, two years. He's a parasite. If you see, this is what I was talking about, about the fucking, the, the fucking selfishness of compassion and altruism. See, your idea of a chance, think about what happens whenever that chance doesn't go through. That means that he hurt somebody else. So whenever you say, oh, I want to be a nice guy, oh, I'm trying to do a good thing, you do that good thing at the expense of another person.
What if he raises a GoFundMe for his treatment? I'm sure he will. Let's see here. Want to? Um, the, they want to. They want to help the victims, right? But I'll just say this much: what you listen to, in my point of view, from my point of view, and I've had, I've been in this situation. I've been in these shoes. Um. I'm going to I'm going to keep it real. You, you you are watching a person that does not has not hit rock bottom or has like the true remorse. He's talking about uh, what's his name? Slicker? That's all that. That's what it looked like to me. He's talking about Slicker. Yeah, I mean, of course. Uh, they're laughing and joking and not thinking about people. Actually, oh, what's this? I'm just hurt. But they're also giving him a way out it became even which worse. is good to help him but they're laughing they're joking no no i don't think it's giving him a way out i think that then there's no way that anybody's gonna get their money away from that like back from that fuck like yeah th th there's no way they're gonna they're gonna get their money back like i get what she's saying but like realistically it won't happen they're not thinking about the fucking people that actually got fucking affected by this because they're rich streamers I'm, don't get me wrong, I'm a rich streamer too. But they don't actually care. But that was like 2019 and I lost it all. Um, I, I don't know, there's no such thing of stopping in gambling. There's no such thing. For me, there was no such thing. Winning, no. Losing, obviously not. Um, so, obviously not. Uh, yeah, uh, it came to Yeah, yeah, so, like, listen, it, it, it didn't make sense. I, I, I think that what she's saying is that... I, I think she's mad because she thinks that streamers paying for the people's losses who gave Slicker the money is somehow going to make Slicker okay or something like that. I, I don't think that's... I don't think that's going to happen. Yeah, I have no idea. Let's see here. Um, she said payback to scam by fans of fans. Yeah, we looked at this before. We'll look at it again. It was scanned by Slicker. You know what? I'll throw an offer out there. I'll throw an offer out there. Okay, I'll throw a curveball. Okay, and I will stick to my word. If Trey wants to, if he wants to join forces with me on a 50-50 split, okay, I will refund half of everybody who has been scammed of any money. A single dollar with proof will go through <laughs> all of them and we'll, and we'll refund them. If she wants to go 50 50, 50 50, how about that? Boom. As long as there's solid proof and the numbers add up and it gets checked on both his side and their side. So double proof, which is, I think it's kind of easy to do. We can do that. It would be easy to do. I, I don't think that, I don't think that Ludwig and XQC have, like, if they want to do that for, like, the people that don't really have a lot of money and whatever, like, I think that's obviously a good thing. Uh, I don't think it gets slicker off the hook or anything like that. Yeah, Train paid enough. Uh, but listen, I don't think it, like, th them doing that has nothing to do with slicker. That's what my opinion is, right? It, yeah. Can we trust X? I mean... Yeah, I think so. It's 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 in the grand scheme of things a very minimal thing that he will be able to do that will look good for a lot of people. So yeah, yeah, I would trust him to be able to do that. It's beneficial for for him to do that, and I, I think so. Yeah. And statistics show uh -huh. that gambling has the highest suicide rate among all addictions. And Slicker is suicidal. And I'm just terrified. What? Did it scam somebody that else? I'm going to wake up one day soon to a phone call that he's killed himself. <sighs> yeah? Is that right? I wonder if he. I wonder if he gave even a single fuck. Like I, I don't give a fuck about Slicker. I don't care what happens to him. He's a piece of shit. And if 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 facing repercussions for scamming people and ruining their lives 
it is somehow going to upset you, then that's too fucking bad. You shouldn't have done that. Like, I, I don't, like, it, it's all, oh, it's hurting his feelings that everybody's calling him out for stealing. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. He's a parasite. He's a fucking sociopath parasite who's preying on people with literal fucking cancer going through surgery to give them more money and you want me to worry about his feelings? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't fucking think so. That's not going to happen. Yeah, it's like I saw people like, oh, I feel bad. Like, oh, you know, like he is really the victim. No, he's not. He's a fucking, he's a, he's a thief and a parasite. Should, he's not even a person. He's, he's not even, like, what kind of a real person does that? Steals fleshlights. Asks people with cancer for money. 16-year-olds. No sympathy. No remorse. Well, guess what? Right back at you. Fuck you. I think Twitch should ban him completely. Absolutely, yeah. I have no, like, this is an absolute piece of fucking garbage. The fake cry is set in stone. I don't think that she's fake. I don't care. I, I don't care if she's fake crying or not because I don't care about how she feels about it. It's not up to her to decide how people should feel about it. I don't have it. Like, I, why the fuck do I care about how she feels? I care about how the victims feel, the people who are actually affected by this, the people whose lives were altered in a massive way. Pretty fucking manipulative. No, it, it, it's, it's somebody that she cares about and, you know, like she, you know, there are always times where you, you, ha you care about somebody and they do something bad and, yeah, maybe they deserve what's coming to them or whatever if they go to jail, but you're still like, oh, man, I'm sad this happened to them. I get it. I understand that. But I just don't give a fuck. I just seriously don't give a fuck. Yeah, if he didn't get caught, he'd still be doing it. Yes, if he didn't get caught, he would still be doing it. He'd be doing it for permabantum so he can get a real job. Yeah, I don't want to have... I swear to fucking God, if Twitch goes and they let this piece of shit go and do like a long subathon, so he lets the viewers subsidize his own fucking fraud, his own thievery, I, I, I'm going to lose my fucking mind. Like, imagine Twitch doesn't ban him, and he comes back, and, and, and then he gives people their money back, maybe, or he gives some people their money back, and he doesn't do the same thing with everybody else. This is uh, uh, unbelievable. It's on YouTube. Yeah, what a horrendous piece of shit. It's crazy. No way the viewers will let that happen. Yes, there will. There's a sucker born every minute. There's always going to be somebody who gets emotionally. They're like, oh, I really believe him. People like this fucking girl. People like these other people that he abused and manipulated for two years into giving him money. You think he can't do that again? He already did it 50, 100 times. What else is there, what else is there to, uh, to go for? Clip doesn't show the full context of why she's crying. I want to explain something to you. If she's crying for any other reason other than for the victims, I don't care. If anything around her crying is sympathy towards Slicker, then I don't give a fuck. I, I don't care what the details are. Like, oh, it doesn't matter. I feel that, like, yeah, I don't, got, oh, it's I'm not exactly that. Yeah, fuck that, man. Let's see here. Slicker has scammed so many people. Let's see here. <laughs> Making jokes about it. And then he, Maze of Rainy goes, oh, no, I don't want you to make it worse. They're coddling him. They're literally fucking coddling him. I disagree with like, Minx. I don't think that's true. I think that they are helping the victims because the reality is there's never going to be a chance that the victims can exact any type of authority over Slicker to give him to to have Slicker give them the money back. There's no way 
Like, I, I, I hope Minx might not understand this. There is no way Slicker is going to be able to pay these people back. It's just not going to happen. Like, I mean, what's he going to do? He, he get, he get, he's not going to stream on Twitch. They're obviously going to ban him, right? I mean, I feel like this is a guarantee. Uh, he's he's going to get banned. And then, like, what's he going to do? He's going to go to McDonald's. He's like, hey, um, yeah, so what did you do for work? Well, I said derogatory things towards women. I call them fake. And then after that, I scammed a bunch of them so I could gamble. He's got no fucking work history. He's got, yeah, Uber. He's going to drive Uber around. He's not going to be able to pay back $300,000 driving Uber. It's not going to happen. Yeah, no, nobody's coddling him. They're only helping the victims. Minx gave Twitter him a lot of money. Scammed so many people. And because he has friends that can pay it off, it's fine. It's okay. Don't worry, everyone. I'm friends with Ms. KF, XCC, and Hassan. Train can just fucking pay my shit. He'll do it again then. He will. Yeah, if, if people show compassion for this at all, he'll do it again. Absolutely. Yeah, he'll, he'll do it again. If, if he's able to rebuild after that, like he's, she's right about this. If he's able to get through this, he will do it again. Absolutely. Like, how is that helping him? My uncle literally has a gambling addiction. This is how it gets worse. Mm -hmm. Because he's being enabled. Yeah. So, like, you see, like, obviously, like, she's looking at it from her perspective as if Slicker could pay the money back. And and the, the universe in which Slicker could pay the money back is less real than Azeroth. Okay? It's not going to happen. Uh, let's see here. Minx calls Hassan. Let's see. Is this okay? So let me let me go back and watch this. Uh, yeah, it's it's not real. I hate them. I hate them. Talking about Miz and Hassan. And it might just be because I'm manic, but I also think that I'm not completely wrong that Ms. Hassan and now Pokey are fake bitches. Yeah, I could see I why she, them. I, I could see why she's emotional about it. it. It makes sense that she's emotional about it because, you know, as she said, her, her, her uh, uncle had a gambling addiction. Slicker. Sorry. Uh, Slicker had, you know, asked her for, she had given Slicker a lot of money and, and so, like, she, she's, like, obviously very personally affected by this. So it makes sense that she's going to feel this way. It makes sense. And, and, like, obviously, I don't think that Miz and Pokey talking to Slicker on stream, I, I don't view this as bad. I don't think that it's bad at all. But I think that if you look at it from her perspective, where she sees it as, like, paying off his gambling debt, then, yeah, I think it would be bad. Like, I don't think that anybody should pay off his gambling debt besides him. If anybody pays off his gambling debt, they are enabling him. But what I'm saying is that it's not real debt because the people that he has the money owed to have no means to recoup the money. They can't get the money back, so it's debt, but it's like cosmetic debt. Oh, this looks, yeah, you technically owe this money, but we can't get the money from you anyway. So it's like, you know, we're using the, the fucking, uh, the Boy Scout system and, uh, you know, Slicker's not in the Boy Scouts. And so that's, that's really where it's out. Slicker, uh, shows he's taking things seriously after Hassan's advice. Oh, I'm sure. Here we go. You've been taking money from people since 2019. It's going to be a lot of fucking work. You know what else was too much work? You fucking taking a day off from streaming to ask people, every single person, including fans of yours, including mods of yours, whatever kind of money you could get from them. That was too much work, but you did it. If you want genuine rehabilitation, which I want that for you, you need to fix yourself and you need to also mend all of the fucking uh, uh, relationships or not relationships, but all the money that you've stolen from people. Yeah, of course, it's going to be too much work. What the fuck do you mean? Right. Right. So, so let's. 
It was too hot on this. No offense. Every time Hassan speaks, my ADHD kicks in. I'm not, not, not to be rude. I'm so sorry. I'm, I, it's just you know me, Hassan. It's too hot to hear you most of the. Guys, he really meant to pay it back. Guys, please feel sorry for him. He's going through such a tough time. He's going through such a. T it's so hard. It's so hard for him. Oh. Oh my god, stop being mean. He doesn't. Don't make him pay back all that money. He's got ADHD. <laughs> oh my fucking god. All right, let's see what this other one is. Uh, Hassan. There we go. Hassan gave him money. Don't worry, this is me. You can call me or DM me or any other platform. Embarrassing to ask. I'm sorry, but at the moment, I'm fucked for bills. It happened. Worst timing. So when he asked that, I was like, all right, yeah, sure thing. Uh, how will I send it without PayPal? I said, also, you realize this looks like you're hacked, right? <laughs> and he said, I got another alt. You could always call me, but I have the alt main is uh, being resolved. Da -da -da. It's a bank again. You don't yeah. trust me, it's good, bro. Wallah, he won't affect our uh, friendship, relationship. I said, no, law, I don't care. I can help if you need it. And then he sent me his PayPal link, and I gave him the money. Um, okay. Then my PayPal got blocked temporarily. And then I said, what happened with Twitch? Did they pay you? Twitch paying me double next month because payments didn't come through. Team Liquid helped me with that. I was like, okay. Because I because I thought he was in need. He was in need of, like, I, I thought he legit needed money. You know what I mean? As a Muslim, this guy doesn't represent us at all. Critical, bro. I, I said this earlier. There is nobody who looks at a man, at, who looks at this parasite, who gambles, uh, incurs interest, drinks alcohol. Like, it's basically like he went through all of the rules of being a Muslim as a, che as a checklist. It's like, okay, I broke this one, next, broke that one, next, next one. Yeah, he's a cockroach. It, nobody thinks that this guy represents you as a Muslim. Like, you guys get fucking stereotyped. All the fucking time, all right? I'm not going to get into that. I'm not going to do that. We all fuck... Everybody who is normal knows that he doesn't represent you, okay? The only people that fucking think that he represents you are people that didn't fucking like you to begin with. And you're never going to get them on your side because they're probably fucking stupid. That's it. Let's see this one. Reiterates why streamers like Mo care about losing, gambling on Twitch, and others like XQC don't. Here we go. The thing is, people like Mo who rely on casino gambling are going to one or not casino gambling who rely on Twitch gambling are one hundred percent going to disagree with us because if they don't have that, poop poop goes their money. When someone like XQC, who actually agrees with us, doesn't care as much because the thing is he doesn't make his money pure bread from just casinos. Or, or from mm -hmm. online gambling. He has other means of income. So, if you're going to call us stupid and pathetic, and first of all, saying I don't, I, I pretend to care is so stupid. Like, you know me, what's... Listening to real Miskiff and Pokemon pretend to care is fucking pathetic. Or picking and choosing what's okay on Twitch. How's casino and real life gambling okay, but online isn't? When the fuck did anybody say that gambling online in real, li in real life was okay? When did anybody fucking say that? They're saying streaming at a casino IRL or streaming poker is okay. Well, yeah, of course streaming poker is different than fucking streaming slots. Listen, if you go play against a... Uh, if you play against a professional poker player, or you are a professional poker player, and you go, and you play against some random-ass fucking guy, and you do a thousand games, you are going to come out with more money than you, that you, than you started with, right? Poker has an element of skill and actual fucking uh, decision-making to it. If you take money and you put it into a slot machine, it doesn't matter how much money you start with. If you play it long enough, you're going to end up with zero dollars. That's just the truth. That's the way the machines work. They're programmed to do that. 
So to think that these two things are the same is fucking ridiculous. If Mo wants to get mad about this, sure, yeah, he can get mad about this, but saying that what they're picking and choosing what's okay on Twitch, yes, that's exactly what they're doing. Just like you're picking and choosing what's okay on Twitch by saying that it's not bad. Everybody is picking and choosing what's okay on Twitch. That's the entire nature of the conversation. Glad you could make it. However, Mo, is it wrong? Even if let's say I'm pretending to care, let's say I have, I have no give, I don't give a shit in the world. Am I doing something wrong? Trying. I don't think I don't think uh, streaming at a casino in real life is any better. By the way, I don't think there's I don't think it's any better. To stop children and, and, and adults from from seeing from being uh, influenced by gambling am i a monster <laughs> like even if i fucking don't give a shit in the slightest am i am i a bad person or am i using my platform for bad no what, what a dumb thing well it, it's just uh, kids underage equals broke equals useless to a casino if kids steal their parents money to play on a casino that equal parents will punish them if it happens again, parents are responsible. How is it hard to understand? Wait, what? Useless to a casino. So, like, I, I don't want to make an argument. Like, I, I think that what he's saying is that, like, kids can't get into a casino. If you go to Caesar's Palace and you're 12 years old, they're going to tell you to leave. Yeah, it has, and it has nothing to do with kids. Why is this, why are we talking about kids? As if Slicker is a kid. He's not a kid. Casinos ask for your fucking ID. Here's the reason why Mo, does Mo, does Mo stream gambling? Does Mo, does Mo stream gambling? Yes, wow, okay, I think I have a, re I think I know why he's upset about this. I think I think I've got an idea. I've got a you know maybe just like maybe ah, fuck what is it? What is the reason? Oh I don't know. Oh it's so hard to think. You know let's be honest. It's his only fucking income. So of course he's gonna defend his fucking job. Like I understand Mo is defending his job. He's gonna do whatever he can. It's his own fuck. It's his fucking career. I get that. But he's wrong. He's wrong in every single way. He's wrong that there is, uh, you know, that there isn't a distinction between online casinos and real life casinos because real life casinos, it's harder to get into them if you're underage. Also, they're effectively region locked. If you're a kid that lives in Austin, Texas, for example, it's going to be harder for you to go to Las Vegas than if you live somewhere else closer to Las Vegas. So it's very obvious that's one thing about it. Also, uh, if kids are broke and they're useless to a casino, uh, it doesn't really matter because you can still get them for a little bit of money it's like if a kid takes his birthday money it's a hundred dollars he gambles it away does it really fucking matter if it's only a hundred dollars because it's all an automated system like nobody's there working at stake approving websites or sorry approving accounts and you know spending the slots for you like this is all done automated so like yeah say this on your main are, are you saying that i'm i'm are you saying that i wouldn't say it on my main I'm confused. Bro, he also says he's a Muslim and he's defending gambling. I'm sad about that. He's not defending gambling. He's defending his livelihood. That's all he's doing. He's he, This is his job. His job is to get kids addicted to gambling. And then how many people does Mo have that watch him? How many average viewers does Mo get? He gets four thousand to two thousand. Let's say, let, let, let's say like four. Let's say four thousand viewers. So let's say ten percent of those four thousand viewers start gambling. Let's say ten percent of those viewers start actually getting addicted to gambling. And then let's say uh, one in five. I think that's the number. Have suicidal thoughts. So that's like what one in every five. That's forty. So that's uh, that's eight people. Uh, and then let's say one of them does it. So every single day, let's say, uh, how many how many souls has this cost? What is the blood price of this? If Mo wants to get, if Mo wants to kill kids, that's fine. Go ahead, but you're gonna have to use better logic.
you're gonna have to try a better fucking argument. Because what he's saying here is fucking stupid. Yeah, try again.